Hey guys, my name is Aya Logan, and in this video is going to be a bit different than before. This is for another school assignment, but in this video, I'm going to be explaining why I really enjoy Minecraft, and why it's been my childhood game for years now. Minecraft. A sandbox game. It has unlimited possibilities, unlimited space, unlimited missions. The world is in your hands. This game was created on May 17th, 2009 by Marcus Alexej Person. Minecraft is a game you can play all day long, and it's very enjoyable to play. I was first introduced to this game in 2011 by my friend named Will. I started playing this game on a pretty bad MacBook because there was barely fast computers back then. I always built houses, went into caves to explore the depths of them, explored the infinite world, traveled to different dimensions. I always looked up how to do this or that in Minecraft, which was a really big help for me. Some sad moments always came along the way. I somehow die from falling too high. I get blown up by a creeper. A skeleton shoots me. I fall in lava. I dig straight down and fall into lava. I dig straight down and fall into a pit of creepers. I dig straight down and fall in a bottomless pit. I somehow manage to drown in water. A spider bit me. What I'm saying is that it has some hard challenges to face in this game. In 2013, I got a much more efficient computer and it was a much better experience. Remember how I always kept dying by all those possible ways? I was in the game mode called Survival, which meant I can die and starve to death. I was introduced to a new game mode called Creative. Creative mode means you have access to all the blocks, you're invincible, you can fly. Minecraft has all these fun things in the game. As of 2019, Minecraft is the best selling video game of all time. Minecraft has a very great soundtrack. It's not stressful, it's not extremely crazy, it's just really calm and aesthetic soundtrack. The entire soundtrack is three hours long, longer than Avengers Endgame. The reason why I enjoy Minecraft so much is that it has single player, multiplayer, realms, mods, so much more. I enjoy playing this game on a daily basis because it reduces stress, depression, and anxiety. And it could be useful for people with those mental problems. Pathos. I compare this game better than a lot of video games because it is one of the best sandbox video games in my opinion. Fact of the day, a normal Minecraft world has around 30 million blocks from corner to corner. If I compared the earth to a normal Minecraft world, Minecraft would be 3,600 times bigger than the earth. Logos. Like I said earlier, I've been playing this game since 2011 and I technically grew up with this game. I play a lot of video games and I understand the basics of them well. This is why I stand behind my argument that Minecraft is an influence in my life. Ethos. Some things in the game are always changing, always randomized unexpected. Minecraft makes me a much more mellow person. Animation. The players also sleep in the game like you just went out for an 18 hour shift at work. Personification. Whenever a player gets hit by an arrow, bit by a spider, falling into a pit of lava, bottomless pit, a pit of zombies, etc. The player normally goes, UGH! Animatopeia. In the game, a golden apple makes you very strong and less likely to die, which makes you a celestial. Hyperbole. This game makes me feel like I'm in a less stressful environment and makes your mind float like you're in space. Simile. Minecraft is a game made out of blocks. No circles, no triangles, just cubes. The colors in the game are really accurate in real life. The diamonds are crystally blue, lapis lazuli is dark blue, emeralds are shiny green. Ah! 